Frank Lindsay here with Pilates On Demand. Today we're hitting a Tabata style Pilates class that you don't need any equipment for. I have a mat, you don't even really need a mat. I'd grab some tennis shoes, maybe some water. So this is gonna combine our Pilates moves with some serious aerobic conditioning. This is an advanced class, it is high impact, so I'd suggest good footwear. You don't need anything, and we're gonna jump right into it. The layout is 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. We're gonna do everything four times, but keep in mind some moves are unilateral, so single-sided, so you'll only do each side twice. So there's not too much rep repetition here. Okay, so I'm going to have a nice loud timer that lets us know when our interval begins, three seconds before it ends, and then our 10 second break. So we'll just be following that. Uh, it's gonna be about a 30 minute workout, and then we will get into the cool down and the stretch. So I just want you to give me a little arm swing. We're not gonna start that timer until we're into our moves. Just opening that chest up. And like I said, I picked out pretty advanced moves. We've got some plyometric today with the Tabata and then pretty advanced Pilates moves because let's take this into big arm circles to the back because we're only doing them for 20 seconds. So you don't have to sustain it for too long. Okay, reverse it, bring it to the front. Good work guys. I'm pumped for this workout. This is really my first kind of conditioning class back of the year. I've been doing a lot of running over the holidays, so I know I'm gonna feel it. We're gonna feel it together. Okay, let's hit some body weight squats. So shoulders on the back, you're gonna drop those hips low and then squeeze your glutes to stand up. Gonna inhale back and squeeze up. I want you to try to really get down into it. Spread those knees apart. Okay, so if you need to, let's wrap that hair up because I'm about to start the timer. We're about to get into this. Just give me a couple more squats. Our first move is kind of like a warm-up cardio move compared to the other ones we're gonna be doing today. Okay, last squat, guys. Okay, mentally prepare. I'm clicking that timer on. It's gonna count us down. Starting in three, two, one. We've got some jumping jacks. So you're gonna jump open, close. So like I said, this is higher impact today. And I want you to push it for the 20 seconds. Keep it up. Okay, recover. Say so we're gonna do scissor jacks. You know I like variety for our next round. Here we go. Legs go forward and back as the arms go up and down. Good, so we're implying, implying, we're applying those Pilates elements here. Make sure your core is tight to protect from that high impact. Good, give it a rest. Scissor jacks. See, you're already halfway through the jumping jacks. It's quick when it's 20 seconds. Let's go, high intensity, three, two, one. Open, cross front, open, cross back. So alternate the legs each time. Let's pick it up, guys. We got this. Good work. Okay, last move, double out, double in. The two hops narrow, two hops wide. So jump in the center, jump wide, jump in the center, jump wide. I'm putting a little bend in my knees when we're bringing it together. Good work. Take it home. Ooh, got a little messed up. <laughs> okay, we're into our first Pilates move. It's push-up pulses. So you have that 10 second break. We're just moving through this workout today. Modify by being on your knees, advance by tucking those toes, you're bringing it down and you're pulsing. So this is really intense because we're keeping it super small. So if you need to, of course, come down onto those knees to modify. You're almost there. Good work, guys. And take a break. Woo, that's an intense move for 20 seconds, huh? 
Okay, I'm gonna try it on my knees this round. Maybe I'll alternate between the two. Okay, modified plank. You're staying low. So you're staying in the tension. Moving one inch up and one inch down. Good, gaze slightly out in front of you. Keeping that neck long. Let's get it. I'm super pumped for this one. Woo! Oh my gosh. I think I'm gonna stay on the knees today. I just gotta honor myself where I'm at. <laughs> okay, bring it down. Drop it low. Little pulses. Elbows are wide. 20 seconds of work, not too bad, right? It's like good for the brain before you're like over the move. You're already out of it. Woo, we're starting to feel the chest. Okay, last round, then we're back on our feet. Here we go. Pick your plank position, drop down, and let's big pulses to finish it up. It's just 20 seconds. Hold on to good form, shoulders down, abs in, almost there. You've got six seconds. Five, four, three, two, try to push out of it on one. Okay, we're on our feet for some jump squats. So you're gonna send those hips back and we jump up. Roll through your foot to land, think toe ball heel. Inhale down. Exhale up, you got it. Getting those thighs on fire now. Good, take a little break. We're gonna take them side to side if you have the space. So jumping laterally. Gonna start to the left. Jump squat to the left. And then jump squat to the right. No worries if you don't have the space. I'm just trying to mix up the cardio so that we stay focused, we stay in it. Good, take it back to the center. Good, recover. Okay, we're gonna jump, turn left, center. Two more rounds. Big breath in, here we go. Jump, face left, jump, face center. Okay, keep those shoulders down. Keep those abs in. Let's move. Crushing my thighs. <laughs> Woo! Okay, this time we jump and we turn it to the right. Deep breath in, deep breath out. Here we go. Jump, turn right. Jump, center. Last one of these, we bring it back to the mat. Next move coming up is gonna be two times on each side, so it's single-sided movements. Woo, okay. Let's take it down to kneeling. Extend the right leg long. Reach those arms to a T. It's like an overhead clap. So we're gonna reach out to the left, clap overhead. Bring the chest back over the hips. Lengthen. Use that right oblique to lift you back up. If you need more, lean further over. Elongate those arms. Big stretch. Last one. Roll it up. Take a breather. Heart rate is kicking. One more time on the side. Tuck your abs in. Here we go. Reach and draw it up, arms to a T. Overhead stretch. Okay, you're clapping your hands right overhead, arms by those ears. Woo! Give me one more. Bring it up, we're switching sides. Kneeling, extend the left foot in line with that right knee, arms to a T. We take our side bend to the right, Clap the arms overhead, and then this time, pulling up through that left oblique. Breathe in, use the core, breathe out. If you can, try to get a little further. Good, and we rest. 
Okay, one more time, then we're back on our feet. Let's set up. Here we go. Stretch, reach, exhale, return. Okay, when we slow down in these Pilates moves, find your Pilates principles, slow controlled movement. We're kind of changing energy systems today from strength to cardio. Give me one more and then back onto the feet. Roll it up. Okay, single leg jumping lunges. Let's put that left foot in front. It's gonna stay in front for the first two rounds. Right toes tucked behind you. Little jump up and down. I want you to fire it up. Nice big hop. If you can, give me that knee tap with that right knee behind you. Okay, you're gonna stay on the same leg. We're making sure it gets a good burn. Big breath in, here we go. One more time on the left. 20 seconds. Shoulders are set. We have good posture. 10. Woo! Oh my gosh, those are killer. Okay, right foot forward, left toes are tucked behind you, hands on the hips. We've got 20 seconds right here. Breathe in, breathe out. Getting that full body work today. Oh yeah, these are getting me. We're gonna make it three. Woo! We got another round of those. And then we're gonna take it into some tricep work on the mat. Mind over matter, right? We're strong. Let's go, 20. Okay, get in the zone. Focus on what you're doing. Not about what's going on later today. Not about if this is tough. Just complete the task at hand. We got this. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's take a layover on the left. Wrap your left hand around your stomach. Lay down on your side, right hand in front of your chest. You're gonna press up and bend the elbow. Tricep press, two times on this side. Keep your elbow close to you and your right shoulder down. Guys, we're 10 minutes in. Okay, take a rest on the floor in 10 seconds. One more time on this right arm. Set it up, hands in front of the chest. Let's go. Okay, four, three, two, one. Switch sides. No rest unless you really need it. Right arm around your waist, left hand in front of the chest, elbows close, shoulder down. Press and bend. Two times on this side and then we're back up into another plyo move. Nice work, okay, let's rest on our side. We're just chilling for a moment but it's a very short moment. Okay, we're back into it. Three, two, one, let's go. Nice job. The first round, it's funny, some of these moves, it's like you do a couple reps, you're like, not bad. And then you get into it and you're like, oh yeah, I feel that. <laughs> Good, one more. Can you bring it to standing? We got some frog jumps. So feet are wide, toes are turned out, tall spine, breathe in, breathe out. Roll through the feet to land, nice work. I'm trying to keep my head and chest back, I'll show you from the side. So you can be here, just make sure you're not here. Okay, standing, standing really straight here is a hip mobility thing. 
Okay, we're gonna add a double pulse at the bottom. Whoo! So you go down, pulse, pulse, and then we jump. Pulse, pulse. Round two of four. That's it. Woo! Okay, this time we're gonna do a heel raise at the bottom and then heels down when we jump. Here we go. So, plie, heels up, down, push through the heel to jump. Little calf raise. We're really getting it all today. That's it. Okay, we're coming into our last round of these. We're gonna go alternating right heel, left heel, and then our jump. And we're back to the mat. Okay, so take it down. Right heel, left heel, jump. Right heel, left heel, jump. Switch the lead leg. Left heel, right heel, jump. Left heel, right heel, jump. You got it. Got some side planks on deck. Woo, okay, come on over. Advanced side plank, we're on the left forearm. Right foot in front, left foot in back. We lift up, the bottom leg pulses. Squeeze it up, using that inner thigh. Two times on each side, open the chest, elongate through the crown of the head. Try not to curl into a ball here. That's it. Last one. Good. Take a little rest. Smooth that breathing out. Okay, guys. One more time on the side. We're up. Watch the form in your supporting shoulder. This is not okay. Okay, you gotta push out of the ground. You can always use that top hand for a little extra support. No problem. Okay, last one. Okay, sweep it over. We're on to the right forearm. Right leg in front, left leg in back. Oh, here we come. We lift. Squeeze the inner thighs. So I'm using my top inner thigh as well, that left inner thigh, to push against the floor to keep my hips lifted. If my left leg doesn't work, my hips are down here. I'm gonna push into the ground to keep those hips up. Good. Okay, one more round, and we're already back onto the feet. You're 15 minutes in. This is flying by. We're up, let's go, 20 seconds. Squeeze your bottom inner thigh to your top inner thigh. Check your form out. That's it. You're six away. Woo! And let's stand it up. Okay, pop squats. Oh, the legs are starting to feel it. You jump open, tap the floor with your right hand. Jump open, switch hands. Open, close. So I'm not jumping high. I'm jumping apart and together. Rest. Okay, we're gonna take these laterally, side to side if you don't have space. Just keep it in the center. Travel it to the left first. Jump open, together. I'm tapping with my left hand as I travel left, and then I'm gonna go right hand as I travel right. It's also good for your brain, right? A little bit of coordination. Okay, we're gonna turn these all to the left. You're gonna tap when you face the left, jump together in the center. You're gonna jump your legs apart, tap left, together center. Tap left, together center. Separate as you turn, bring it together through center. Using the left hand to tap between the legs each time. Okay. We're gonna do that to the right. 
And we're back to the ground for some reverse tabletop action. Here we go, legs together in the center. Jump apart, turn right, tap with the right hand. We're together. There's a little bit of agility here because you have to stop yourself when you turn, right? 10 seconds. Okay, bring it to the ground. Single leg tabletops. Let's ground that right foot. Left leg tabletop, open your chest, drive up through the right foot, tap it down. Now I'm gonna cue these slower. Pause, squeeze at the top. Work your right glute and hamstring. That's it. Okay, take a rest, stay on the same leg. Trying to get a little bit more burn, right? Big breath in, deep breath out, set up. Here we go. Drive, squeeze, hold. That's it. Okay, you got seven. I just stuck the landing. <laughs> okay, left leg, 20 seconds. Left foot in line, let the hip, toes point forward. Open your chest, right leg tabletop. Pinch your shoulder blades together in your upper back. You better be breathing deeply here. Do not hold your breath. Good. We're breathing, here we go. Left leg, drive it up. Okay, we're coming into the last 10 minutes. Those are always mentally the toughest. But remember, our mind plays tricks on us. Check in, are you really that tired? You may not be, it might just be the idea that the workout's about to be over, okay? We're up, we got some single leg hops on the right foot. Woo, right foot down, left leg up. Here we go, little hops. If that's too much on your knee, hop with both legs. Good work, guys. Try to stay stacked in the chest and hips. Okay, and take your break. Same leg. Side to side is your variation. Here we go, right leg down, jumping side to side. Keeping it small, doesn't have to be big. Okay, this definitely works a lot of ankle mobility. Last 10. Good, take your recovery, okay? Single leg hops on the left, coming up. Here we go, straight up and down to start. You can pretty quickly tell what the stronger leg is here. At least I can. That's it guys. Okay, take your break. Side to side is your option. Then we're already back to the mat for some outer hip side kicks. Left foot down, side to side. Last 10. Five. Good, take your break. Side kicks, kneeling on the left knee. Extend the right leg to the right of the hip. Left hand is underneath the shoulder. You're gonna lift that right leg up, give me three pulses. One, two, three, hold, squeeze. One, two, three, hold, squeeze. Tuck your tailbone. Make sure you're parallel in that right leg. One, two, three, hold, squeeze. One, two, three, hold, squeeze. Take a rest. 
We are flying through this. Set it up, get your right leg high, it stays high. Pulse it for three, pause at the high point. Halfway. Give me one more. Big squeeze at the top. Take it down, other side. Kneeling on the right leg. Left leg to the left of the hip. Right hand underneath the shoulder. Pull your abs in. We lift, we pulse one, two, three, hold. Pulse one, two, three, hold. I want you high enough that you are in a quivering position. Own it, you're almost at the end of this workout. Last one. Ooh, take a little rest. Okay, last one, and we got some burpees. Here we go. Take it over, left leg up, pulse one, two, three, hold. Try to keep your lower back from arching. Good work. Give me one more and just a big squeeze at the top. One, two, three, squeeze it. Ah, take it down. Okay, burpees. Okay, the first one we're gonna jump it standing and walk the feet out into the plank. Jump it up. Plant the hands, step right, left, right, left. Jump it up. Step, 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 and jump. Now pick the pace up. Okay, this time you're gonna lead left with the step. Ready? Jump at the top. Left, right, left, right. Jump at the top. Shoulders are strong. Abs are in. You're in a plank position. Okay, this time we're gonna do a rolling push up to the floor. Ready? Jump at the top. Plant the hands, jump the feet out, roll it to the floor, roll it up, jump the feet in, jump it up. Let's do it. Let's go guys. One more. Jump it up. Okay. No push up. Straight up burpee with the jumps. Last round, let's go. Up, down, out, in, up, down, out, in. 15 seconds. Gaze out in front of the hands. One more. Woo! Okay, take it to the ground. We got some extension. Lay on your belly. Arms behind you, palms to the floor. Lift everything up, squeeze the back. Lower everything halfway down. Lift up. Pinch your shoulder blades together. Lower down. Guys, this is home stretch. Less than four minutes, and then we literally stretch. So don't throw the towel in. Okay, 10 second break. Then we're gonna do palms facing up towards the ceiling. Hold it at the top, lift everything up and pulse the arms. Squeezing through that upper back. Good, tuck the tailbone more and elongate your head and toes apart. Squeeze more and more through that upper back. Woo! Okay, two more moves. This time we're gonna do back crunches. So pin the tops of your feet to the floor. They stay down, arms by the waist, chest is up. Pulse your chest. Don't let your legs or hips move. Move from your middle back. Your abdomen is in and up. Good work, guys. Okay, last move for the Pilates is arms overhead 
with the pulses. So take your arms to a T or a V, thumbs up, tuck the tailbone, lift the arms and the chest up, and pulse your arms and chest up. Try to keep those feet heavy. You're almost there. We're into our last cardio move coming up. We're finishing strong, you guys. Last five, four, three, two, one. Okay, stand it up. We've got big jumps forward and we're gonna run it back. Feet are mats distance, big jump, run it back. Okay, I think they call these broad jumps. If you don't like the big jump, you can squat walk it. Good work, guys. Woo! Okay, we're gonna take a jump forward and a jump back. Squat down, jump forward, jump back. Jump forward, jump back. Forward power, back power. You can definitely see it's easier for me to jump forward. That's okay. Last one, jump it back. Woo! Okay, we're gonna run it forward, jump it back. Lots of variety, let's go. Jog it forward, big jump back. Maybe let's make that two, if they're not feeling that big, like mine. You've got 30 seconds of work left for this whole workout. Okay, little jumps forward, little jumps back. This is where we finish, 30 whole freaking minutes. Let's go. Stay low, hop it forward, whatever width you have, and then we're gonna hop it back. Now try to pick it up. So they're small, but they're mighty. Last 10, can you drop it a little lower in those hips? Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. All the high fives to you. Walk it out, step it out, whatever you need. Recover that breathing. We're gonna let this interval timer know we're done with you for the day. Uh, that was 60 intervals, 30 minutes. That's a pretty strong work there. So once the heart rate feels like it comes down, I wanna take it into a stretch here. So just take a wide stance. Right palm to the right thigh. Left arm takes us up and over into a juicy side bend. Leaning the top arm and the head back. Wave it up, left palm, left thigh. Right arm slides us over into a nice side bend. Leaning the head back into it. Roll it up. You're gonna put your right hand on the floor in between your feet, maybe it's just the fingertips. Inhale, big twist. Opening that left arm to the sky. Bring it through center. Left fingertips or palm in front of your face. Right arm reaches up. Big twist. Bring it through center. Bend your knees, roll it up. You're gonna bring your feet a little bit wider than hips distance. I'm gonna take this to the side. Bend in the knees, hands to the ground. If you can't reach the floor, put your hands on a couch or a chair. And then let's alternate and extending those legs. I try to keep an elongated torso. Good work. Bring it down through center. So you're gonna now just turn the feet out from this position. Drop those hips nice and low. Bring your elbows to your knees, getting a deep groin and hip stretch. Right arm reaches right, left arm leeches, reaches, not leeches up to the high left diagonal. Bring it through center, hook the back of the left shoulder to the inside of the left knee. Twist up and open to the right, taking a big breath in. Then bring it through center, point the toes forward, heel toe the feet together any amount, and just shake it out. Give me a couple more deep breaths right here. 
Then coming through center, bend the knees, roll up the spine, stand it up nice and tall, and give yourself a hand. You guys, that is a challenging workout. You're gonna see serious results in your cardio performance and your strength, because we took pretty much zero breaks. I know 10 seconds seems like it's a, it is a break, but it's just more like a different pattern of doing things. It's not really that long of a break that you're getting this huge recovery, and that allows us to work really hard during that 20 seconds. So you guys, thank you so much for joining me today. As much as you think I'm keeping you accountable, you are certainly keeping me accountable. I show up because you're there on the other end. I'm not kidding. So I hope you have a freaking fabulous day. My name's Lindsay Bushman. This is Pilates On Demand. We like to kind of do it all here, keep it fresh. So please hit that subscribe button. It is 100% free for you to subscribe to my channel. It doesn't cost you a dime. It just lets YouTube know you like my content and helps support me. So I really appreciate that. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye guys.